let me explain. Here it goes. A is for ambition. B, what I want to be. C, past the situation that's in front of 3.4 mile, $13 order straight out of the gate for Uber. It's two orders, but pretty good payout for 3.4 miles. So order number one, let's go. Most common viewer question is what type of electric scooter should I buy? My short answer is you should buy a Dultron. If you click the link in the description, I get paid a little bit if you buy anything through there. If you want to ask me questions about what type of scooter is right for you, talk to me. Leave me a comment, leave me a question, and I'll walk you through what you need to think about when buying an electric scooter. I get ran over out here. Well, not a huge payout, but it is like 13 and a half bucks. Uh, I just had to turn down a pretty good $13.50 one and a half mile from DoorDash, but I'm pretty much committed to this double here. Howro and Claire, nice names. How you doing guys? I got Howro and Claire. Might as well get the box ready here. I think everything's gonna fit on this top shelf. It looks like two small orders. All the uh, Uber and the Grab uh, and DoorDash, they're doing wonderful. Postmate nope. an hour. Postmates is always suck. Here we go. So this is one. Alrighty guys, thank you very much. Alright, we'll see you later. Alrighty. Oh. Oh my god. Alrighty, see so yeah, this is all gonna fit very nicely. Perfect. Alright, we're on the road. We got a double. I hate when I get here and I don't know the address. I always should look before I get on the road, right? 7062. We're close. Entry. Hi, enjoy. Thank you so much. Hey, my pleasure. Thank you, Claire. Soda's in there. All right, that's number one. Now we got to do this uh, order for Howro. H-A-W-R-O. What kind of name is that? Yeah, that's why this whole order was 3.4 miles, because now it's 1.8 miles from where we're at now. And we got to go, we got to go slow. It's an Uber order, so let's take our time and enjoy the ride. It's nice out. The sun's starting to come out. I'm dressed for cold weather, though. On the way to this order, we just picked up an $8 two-mile Chipotle order from Sunset. I think we should be on time for the pickup. We're close on this one. Oh my God, it's got the delivery code and everything. These are tough. Uh, I remember this place now. Right. Top floor, unit 14. I remember this guy. It's not the first, it's not the first stairwell, it's the second. Food here. Do we have time to get to this DoorDash order is the question. Well, it says be there in a minute. If we're four or five minutes late, that's okay. So let's do it. We turned off Uber so we can just get a little more speed. I don't want to be more than like four or five minutes late on this. Come on. I just want to run this light, we're way too far. I'm still gonna run it, but I'm gonna look first. Hey, yep. All right, let's go. Oh. I think we're even two minutes late, maybe three minutes late. <laughs> All righty, of course, the last one that I look at today, but we got it. And here's one insider's secret. What I do is, now that we've picked up the food and we're not late for the pickup on DoorDash, I'm gonna slow us down, go back to first gear on the scooter, which limits us to like low 20 mile per hour range, and we can go back to work looking for jobs on Uber while we're delivering this. You just gotta be good at your job selection. You know, your ratings will speak for you. We did get an Uber order in West Hollywood. It's a 12 and a half dollar payout, it's pretty good. And we're going to West Hollywood, so let's do this delivery first, and then we'll do the Starbucks order. I've never been to the Starbucks in uh, Boys Town, though. Even though the long pre runs east to west in every other part of town, this is the only spot that runs north to south. I know where we're going. I remember this is a confusing drop-off. I'm pretty sure it's right up here around the corner. Pretty sure this is it. 
the question is, is what does this customer want me to do? Uh, we got a code, we're going in. Uh, at least this is a really small light order. What is the code? Uh, where are we going? 17, 17 is never on the first floor. This is not on the second floor either. Okay. What the fuck? 17, right? Wait, am I fucking drunk? 15 and this is 18 and 19 up there. Am I fucking stoned? Oh my god. You gotta be fucking shooting me. That's what we call a clusterfuck of a delivery. Oh my god, I'm all turned around. Okay, I, get, I know how to get out of here. All right, let's get this good at fucking Starbucks run. <laughs> and while I'm rushing to do this, I realize this is one of these orders that says customers has reported shit missing. Starbucks never misses stuff, so I'm not doing this order. All right, now we have a two mile Starbucks order for $7.59. We are gonna take that, we'll definitely do that. There's a DoorDash coming in behind it, but we don't work for $4.75, so let's go. Left. There he is, I already see it. All right, we're going to Sunset. It says located directly next to Chibo. That sure helps a lot. Let's pretend like we're going to Chibo. All right, it looks like we're going to this art store directly next to Chibo. How you doing? All right, here you go. Enjoy. Thank you. Have a good Thank one. you. Oh. It's okay. Oh. I feel like I'm going to rush to get out there because I'm pretty confident that that shit fucking spilled. It looked pretty wet when I took it out of the bag, but I'm going to move out of her eyesight make it look like I'm gone as far as she knows. Fuck, that sucks. Yeah, the bag's a little wet. Not my fault. Damn, this is a $15 order for four miles. Uh, I don't like this order. I'm not going to take it. It's always tempting to try to make 15 in a shot like that, but it's not a good payout. It's too far. Looking at this order, it's pretty easy because one of the drop-offs is Wale Studios. I know exactly where that is and people definitely, I just usually leave that with the security guard. So let's go Flame Broiler. It's down at the Target Center. All right, we're early. Thank you. Hey bro, I got Darnell and Shane. Please don't tell me you gotta cook these. Shane. I got it? two. I got Darnell and Shane. Two, dos. Darnell and Shane. I'm just Shane and... Uh, That's it, both of them. If they're not cooked, I have another order. I can go... Are, are they not cooked yet? Oh, ready. They're ready? All right, let's go. I'm ready. You're ready. You're ready to wait. Okay. Dude, they got these little fucking little, little like sauces on top in these tiny little cups. They're like guaranteed to fucking spill. Oh, that guy is terrible. I was before. I don't want to come back to this fucking flame boiler. I remember what this happened last time I was here. Now I remember this poor guy is just there all by himself. So, but the way he's got those three sauces at the top, if that explodes into the box, into the package, that is going to suck. All right, 1650 is 1650. Let's go. My sat nav is just giving me like the worst directions. I think it's some of the streets are closed off around here or something. I don't know, but I know where we're going. 1010. How you doing? Not sure if you're, you look like you're waiting for food. Oh, perfect. Okay, excellent. Let me get out of the street. Oh my God, did he not even label these things? Holy crap. Yeah, flame bro. It's still the worst of deliveries. I mean, their food is nice. You order a single bowl with like three sauces in the bowl. I don't know why this guy would ever hand me. I'm very. Side chicken. Oh, side chicken. That's got to be the same. Okay, man. Good call, sir. Thank you very much. Thank you. On top of everything, this guy gave me the order with no receipts on the food. You gotta be kidding me. We're going to Raleigh Studios. It's about a mile, 1.3 miles from here. 
Uh, where's the entrance to the Oh, gate closed. Lures she made on, oh, on Van Ness. Shit, I gotta put my helmet back on if we're going all the way over to Van Ness. I assume customers come down for food here. The, uh, Shane W, Sweet E. Hi, Shane, it's your DoorDash. I'm at the security gate. Awesome, thank you. All right, we're waiting for somebody named Francine to be down here in 30 seconds. She's sending somebody down named Francine, if that rings a bell to you. Yes. Okay. He said he was, he he was going to be down in like one second, like two seconds. I, you, I never leave food with you. You're, you're not going to take it, right? No. Okay. Exactly. Who the person? What the fuck does it matter? I mean, it's... it's, 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 it's what does it really matter? I mean, you can't do anything about it right now, obviously. Uh, they said, they're, oh, down in 30 seconds. And it's just 30 whatever. Seconds. The problem is you have this other gate that they might have gone down to the other gate, right? They better know. I'm going to leave the food here. Uh, th this has got to be her coming out of a nice slow saunter. But why don't you run, lady? Run, lady, run. Oh, my God. Hey, I have food for Shane. Are you Francine? Can I, can I come in, security? No, you got to stay right there, man. Thank you. Thank you. Fuck this place. I'm never coming back to this fucking place again. Oh my god. All right, so we know Raleigh Studios is off the fucking list. <laughs> These guys are riding like assholes. I figured I'd ride right behind them. These fucking guys went around me in a very bad way. I'll just follow them. Let them get hit first. Oh, they're making a right though. I'm going straight. Yeah, those fucking assholes went around me in a bad way. We got an $8.75 order from Furridge. Plenty of time to get there. Some maneuvering right there. Uh, they're not gonna be, oh, it's all wet out here. What the fuck? Oh my God, well, not everywhere. It's gotta be careful. All right, I'm shade. I know we're not gonna be ready. I'm six minutes early on the pickup. This place is never early, so I'm just gonna sit down and chill. Uh, even though we're still a couple minutes before the uh, pickup time, let's take a chance. D-U-O-N-G. Hi guys. D-U-O-N-G. Beautiful. Thank you. Look at this like thin fucking paper handled bag. Two fucking heavy things of soup in here. Ridiculous. <laughs> Seems so familiar. Is it the same as the art shop? They didn't give us the same direction. 7523. I did that. I'm glad I noticed it. The guy was obviously out here looking for his food, but I was right next door. I'm glad I caught that. Damn. Urban ramen, 1.1 miles for 650. You know, it's slow. Do I? Uh, guess I'll take it. Uh, I hate that. 650. I want a better order. I'm not gonna take it. Got a Mendocino Farms run for 875. God, it is for far though. It's too far. I'm not taking it. Three miles. Forget it. I need a better deal. We're at about 55 bucks for an hour and 55 minutes. How do you like that? 17.63 miles. Still working. Plenty of juice left. I think we got a good order from Mendocino Farms, which we are kind of right in front of. 1.5 miles, but it's 1.5 miles from here. 975. Let's take it. Look at that. That's a good order right there. Matthew R. Yeah, I don't think it's up here yet. Okay, my DoorDash order isn't ready from this place, and I got a Uber order going in the same direction just now. Uber orders are usually ahead of DoorDash, so let's see if either of these are order ready. So it's Matthew for DoorDash and Thomas for Uber. The Uber order should be ready any second. So let's just get this in the box. 
No luck with uh, Matthew yet? Okay. This is a good one. This Uber order is going pretty far into West Hollywood, but it's 12.50, and the DoorDash is going towards West Hollywood, so perfection. Except for the fact this DoorDash is just fucking taking forever. Excuse me. Oh, man. Hey, guys. What's going on with this order for Matthew? It feels like it's getting super late at this point. One second. Super late on this order. I mean, luckily the Uber order, I haven't even swiped that I picked it up yet. It's no big deal, but these motherfuckers. I contacted the uh, DoorDash customer because I mean, he's like, I'm just so used to these places not being late. When they're late, it really, really fucking throws me off. I mean, 12, 10, 12 minutes late. That's like a lifetime in this business. All right, so we got both these orders. We're going to West Hollywood and we're going to make like uh, at least 20 bucks for it. So that's good. <laughs> God damn it. This is first drop off is extra easy because it's, uh, same guy we did yesterday. We dropped off in the Zanku parking lot, so it's good that we know where we're going. Right. Matthew, right? Yep. All right, bro, enjoy. Okay. Thank, you. Thank you. All right, there's the DoorDash order down. Now we just gotta do the Uber order, which is all the way down on Rosewood, not too far. I might have made a mistake batching these orders together. The second order was actually 2.2 miles away. And it just feels like it's taken us forever to get there. Man, these asshole drivers in Beverly Hills fucking suck. All right, so we're close now. 85, where are we going? 85.33. I don't see any numbers anywhere, of course. I think this is it. I think the number is hidden up. Oh, right here. Look at this hidden behind this door. How could anybody see the, uh, how could anybody ever see this address? Look at this, how could anybody see the address? The address, the address is behind this bush. All right, now we have a good 1.1 mile Chipotle for eight bucks. Which Chipotle though, where are we going? Oh, the Beverly Chipotle, fuck. I did not mean to take that. Oh, that might take us way too far south from here, but whatever, might as well do it. Beverly Chipotle and they were delivering over to La Cienega which is really close to here. So, I mean it's a good order for eight bucks especially if they're ready. We haven't been down here since we were down here during the protest. Hi. Hi. You're working on John Jay for uh, DoorDash? Thank you very much. Have a good one. You too. Oh, I'm happy they're ready. wonder why they're not using their racks. I gotta get to the left, but I got all this traffic boxing me in behind me. I'll let it pass. Oh yeah, look at this. Our destination is right across the street. Hi, for John Jay. Yes. Thank you very much. Thank you. All right, easy enough. We've been working for two hours, 44 minutes. We made at least 80 bucks. Look at this crazy guy. You better be precise because I'm fully prepared. One of us gonna leave here. All right, I guess he's rapping. All right, so we might call it a day. We are close to five guys. I said it last time I posted a video that it's been a while since I got a burger. I haven't gotten a burger since then, so now I mean it. Let's maybe go get a burger. Can I get a double burger with bacon, no cheese, tomato, grilled onion, mushroom, Mustard and ketchup. And give me a large fry and I'm just gonna drink what? Let me explain. Here it goes A's for ambition. Be what I wanna be. See past the situation that's